The current cold snaps have given us picture postcard images like these. But the slippery conditions it's created underfoot can be treacherous. Some A&E departments have been busy as a result when they're, well, quite under quite enough pressure as it is. So how are the teams in hospitals dealing with this? And can you do anything to try to prevent taking a tumble in the first place? Here's Indiana Grant. Icy conditions in January. No surprise there. Some grit can be the difference between your feet or your posterior being on the pavement. Hospitals already struggling with COVID are seeing a rise in people hurt falling on the ice. We've been working very hard over the past few days uh, on the background of issues that I'm sure I don't need to go into here. In addition with the cold weather, the ice, the snow, we've had dozens more people attending the emergency department with falls and trips and road traffic collisions. And it's been pretty upsetting on top of everything else. Local authorities say they're doing their best. Aberdeen has used 50% more salt this winter than last, and that's just in the past two weeks. Try as they might, gritters just can't get to every road and pathway each time there's a cold snap. And so it falls to local communities to de-ice their walkways. Councils like here in Aberdeenshire have been providing supplies for DIY gritting. I know the council, they're busy flat out just now. Um, there's only so much hours in the day, so they can't get around all the streets like so. I'm just doing my bit to help out. There's a shop just down the road here so there's a lot of older people go down and get their papers in the morning and stuff and uh, yeah just need to just keep safe. So how do you take the icy pavements in your stride? How do you end up more like Torval and Dean and less like Bambi? Try and lower your centre of gravity. So um, if you're tall, just try and actually just bend your knees a little bit more. Um, just don't have your hands in your pockets. So if you do have a slip or a slide, uh, that your arms can at least help balance a little bit. The freezing temperatures are likely all week, so take care out there. Inja Grant, Reporting Scotland.